I am back and today we're going to be doing another get ready with me. I haven't done a get ready with me since last quarter of school. I'm in university. I'm on the quarter system. We're currently halfway through spring quarter. This quarter has been rough. That's why I haven't been doing like longer videos to film like get ready with me. But today I have some great lighting. I have um, a little bit of free time. So I thought we would do just kind of a fun get ready with me hang out. I feel like very OG YouTube. I'm sitting on the floor. I was drinking coffee earlier and uh, I had too much coffee. So we're not gonna be drinking. Uh, we're not gonna be that OG YouTube, but we're gonna be like pretty close. We're sitting on the floor in front of a window. So uh, that is going to be today's get ready with me theme. I'm just hoping to do something really fun and fresh and work with some project pan products that you may recognize if you are following all of my project pans. So without further ado, let's hop straight into this video. First, I'm going to go in with my Max strobe cream in the shade pink light. This is just a little sample that I got from somewhere. Um, I feel like I should before sitting down to film make a list of all the things that I should talk about um, because what ends up happening is I start talking about one thing and then I um, get distracted and then forget to talk about the things that I actually was going to talk about. Um, so let's let's start where I think I left off with my life. Um, I Spring break was good. I went home for a little bit and then came back, uh, spent some time with friends that I don't normally get to see. Now I'm going in with my Smashbox Minimize Pores Primer and then I'm just gonna smush this into the center of my face. Um, so yeah, I got to see some friends and what else did I do? Okay, so right after spring break um, was my birthday and it was really fun. Um, in the past, I haven't always done things for my birthday. They haven't always kind of gone according to plan. There's been drama or um, I just didn't feel like throwing anything because of where um, I was at in life or whatever or I just ended up doing something small with like one or two friends but this year I was kind of like you know I do really love my birthday and I want to do something fun we don't even have school on the day of so we um my friends worked really hard to make it really special and I greatly appreciated that and um it was just really nice of them. So first of all, on the day of, we did a photo shoot. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, um, I will make sure to um, link my handle down below. I think it's Daily Dose of Sparkles with the Z, I wanna say. With the actual, I'll, I'll make sure to write it down below. Anyways, um, one of the photos that we took is up there, or some of the photos. This, I'm just taking two pumps of my Smashbox 24-hour um, photo studio skin hydrating foundation in 212 light neutral um, and I'm just gonna dab that all over my face anyway so we did a photo shoot it was me my roommate and my good friend Rosalind and my good friend Max um, got dragged along and he was our like pseudo photographer when we were just doing solo pictures um, one of the girls would take over, usually Rosalind, because she's the best photographer of the three of us. But, and then when we did, like, group pictures, then Max stepped in and was our photographer. He was also, um, our helper, just in general. He, we, it was so silly, but so much fun. We did, like, prom dresses on the beach. Um, and so it was, for Max, we were just like, Maxwell, help Rosalind get off the rock. Maxwell, like, hold, like I need you to hold my dress while I climb over, like, this big patch of ocean. And, and he was just running around. He was so sweet about it. He was so bored. <laughs> like, of all the ways he could have spent his day, that was definitely not the one. But I, And I thanked him copiously. But he was just like, Jasmine, this is your day. This is what you wanted to do. So I'm going to do it, and I'm going to complain minimally, and I got you. So that was so much fun. I was so happy to do that. And then my birthday was on a Wednesday. We didn't have school because uh, it's a it's a holiday. F I didn't know that until coming to my school. Thoughts and words, thoughts and words. That Friday we did something like as kind of a bigger group. And that was a lot of fun. We were going to do a murder mystery 
and then it was just kind of one of those things where we were like oh we'll do the murder mystery in a little bit like we'll start it in a little bit um this is my elf camo hydrating concealer and light beige um and then we just were all having a lot of fun just kind of hanging out um that we ended up never playing doing the murder mystery so we still have it um we really need to but it was it was a lot of fun i am really happy i made cupcakes and i am so angry with myself that i didn't get a picture of them because they turned out so cute they had beautiful corn sprinkle and before anyone comments like you made your own birthday tree i love baking and i really wanted to so I did. Like, if I hadn't been like, I have a plan for what I want to do for my birthday cake thing, then my friends totally would have gotten slash made one. It was just, I was like, this is what I want to do. And I kind of planned it out in my head and then just announced, like, the week of, like, oh, this is what I'm doing on Friday. And they were like, you're baking for yourself? And I was like, yes, I really love baking. Nikki, what are you doing? This is Nikki. Or come here. I know, I know, I know. This is Nikki. She is the sweetest little puppy dog in the whole wide world. Okay, I'm done torturing you. Um, I'm hanging out with dogs for the day. Uh, which is pretty much the best job anyone could ever give me. That's why I'm not in my normal setup. This is a family friend's house. What do you think you're doing? What you smelling? My friends, are, they made me feel really special. I really greatly appreciate all of them, and oh wow, that is a lot of powder that's getting everywhere. I'm taking my Cody Airspun and just spilling all over my shirt. Oh, it was just very sweet of them, and I great. I keep saying like, oh, I really appreciate them, and it's not that like friends haven't done things in the past for my birthday special. They definitely have. They just um... sorry, I just completely lost my train of thought there. It's just last year my birthday hit like right as COVID was hitting, so it was just kind of like, oops. I guess you're turning 19, and then this year, it was like, nothing can hold us back. I have the most fun. So I'm finally 20, uh, and yeah, it's been, it's been good. I've had an interesting quarter. I just went and did my brows off camera with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz, which is in my graveyard project pan, because yes, I started a new project pan, because <laughs> I didn't have enough products I was panning. Anywho, so... Yes, that was week one. Um, and this quarter I am taking a lot of units and it was not my best idea. Uh, not gonna lie. I, it has been a struggle. I am not doing as well as I wanted to. And that has been hard because, um, there it is. I'm just gonna take my Smashbox eye primer. It's been hard because I set high standards for myself. But, um, I think it's going to be a good opportunity for growth of me being like, I am trying my very best. There is not much more time I could dedicate to school, like, just in general. Like, unless I was going to stop working out, stop seeing my friends, and stop doing things to take care of myself, like, cooking and cleaning the apartment um there like that's that's what i do when i'm not working on school i'm just gonna take the shade halo from my tarte park avenue princess palette and dust this over the eye primer um so i there's not much i can do and yes i do see my friends and yes like hypothetically i could be studying during that time and I don't want to be like, oh, well, seeing my friends is a necessity, but unless I want to absolutely go insane, it's kind of a necessity. So, like, I could probably find, like, another hour or two in my schedule each week. I don't, I don't want to sit here and be like, I could be doing so much better, because in reality, I don't know if I could, and it, maybe this is my best, and that's something that I'm accepting. Now I'm taking my Tarte, um... Tartist Pro to Go palette and uh, the shade Crisp and I'm just starting kind of on my lid and working that up lightly into the crease. So that's been good and then lately I've been trying to figure out what I'm doing over summer. Um, so I still have no clue what I'm doing over summer and depending on what I am um, I might take a break from YouTube. 
and I would still update my project pans, um, but I would probably like space it out and I wouldn't be doing two videos a week anymore. Um, and that's mainly just logistics. Like I don't have a place to film at my dad's house. Um, so if I'm with my dad 90% of the time, then I don't, I'm not gonna be able to film 90% of the time. Um, depending on what I'm doing, I may have really good progress on my project pans because I may be uh, not having like a space to like do a little makeup caddy. I might have to be like out of a may I might have to be working completely out of this for all my toiletries or something and then that means I'm definitely using this palette every day. I'm just gonna take this little eco tool brush and smudge it on my lower lash line. Um so we shall see how that goes. Yeah, I'm really hoping to work for some work on something that's related to my degree. I don't know if you're new here, but I'm studying biomedical engineering, so I'm really hoping to do something like researchy, but um COVID has really screwed up a lot of those opportunities, so we're working with what we have. Um, I was supposed to do an internship last summer and it got canceled because of COVID, which was unfortunate. And they're not reopening that specific position, so I couldn't just do that this summer, um, which kind of sucks, but it is, it is what it is. Um, I'm just going to take this Lancome eyeliner in the shade Black Coffee and line my upper lash line like waterline and then I'm just gonna kind of switch back to face and take my real techniques blush brush and dip it into these two shades and I'm just gonna bronze up my neck what else oh my best friend Carmen is gonna be here in three weeks for three three weeks I want to say three weeks I'm bouncing off the walls excited and she's gonna be here for longer than she was last time um, she came down for Halloween and the plan as of right now is to film together. So Carmen, if you're watching it, I've committed to this on YouTube officially, so you have to now. She wants to, I'm not forcing her to do anything. I'm just gonna lightly bronze up my temple cheek region. Okay, and then now that we're bronzed, I'm just gonna take my Tarte Party Blush and I'm doing kind of less bronzer and more blush than I normally do because I'm hoping to do kind of a lighter look today. I say as I pile on blush. <laughs> do you even see me? Sometimes I feel like natural lighting almost looks worse on camera. I don't understand. Or not looks worse, but makes me look more washed out. Um, but yeah, so she's going to be on my channel. I'm thinking it would be fun to do like a tag, just like us sitting and chatting. And then it might also be fun to do like me doing her makeup or something. Um, I love doing people's makeups, makeup. I would love to do like a series where I did all of my friends makeup someday. That's just not really in the cards right now. Cause I have, most of my friends don't really know I do YouTube videos. Um, some of them have found my Instagram where I talk about this kind of stuff, but most of them are just vibing. They don't question me when I come down, like when I come out at 9 p.m. at night wearing like full glitter. They're just like, ah, oh, Jasmine got bored and did her face again. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna take my Becca highlighter in Champagne Pop. I can't hold it up because it's broken. Uh, if you saw that pan that palette or pan, project pan update, I'm just kind of hitting the high points of my face and the inner corners of the eye. Some of them are a little crazy with the highlighter. And then I'm just gonna take my blush brush and I'm going to dip it in the blush and then kind of tap it lightly in the highlighter. to Pick up a little bit of both and I'm just gonna kind of run over the tops of my cheeks just to kind of get a glowy blushy effect. My best friend Carmen. I'm not out her right now. She used to do this thing where if she wanted me to do her makeup, she would do it. I don't want to say badly because that I, that sounds rude. She would like purposely do stuff wrong 
while making direct eye contact so that I would be like, stop, no, give it, give me the brush, give me the brush. Like she would like hold brushes like this and like take foundation in her palm and just go like, like this instead of like blending it in with your finger. No, yeah. Like making direct eye contact. So, uh, it's fun. And, and then I would do her, I'd be like, give it to me. And then I'd end up doing her makeup. So I love doing Carmen's makeup. And then I used to pay Carmen back for that and be like, okay, so you're going to do my hair now, right? Now I have to learn how to do my own hair, which is why we're seeing this sad attempt at something cute and trendy. Um, <laughs> I don't even know if it's trendy. I don't know trends. So, it'll be fun having her back. Okay, I gave my face a quick spritz. By quick, I mean full dousing with my Max, my Mac Fix Plus. My Mac Max. Bleh. And then um, I am just going to go in with my Italia Deluxe Lip Liner in the shade Nude. And line and kind of mostly fill in my lips. Yeah, she's coming down, super excited about that. And yeah, and so I have five weeks left of this quarter and then summer hits. I really don't know what uploads are gonna look like this summer. It would be cool if I could upload more, but again, not really sure about that. Um, we shall see. And then I'm just gonna take this Clinique gloss in the shade Rosewater Pop. I don't know if you can tell, but we're getting down there with this one. Then I'm just going to take the teeniest, tiniest bit of this Boss shade on my fingertip, and I'm just going to smudge it like really close to my lash line. And then I'm just going to take this Bare Minerals Lash Topia Mascara and generously coat my lashes and I will be right back. Hey guys, I am back and this is going to be the finished look. I may have stabbed myself in the eye with the mascara and uh, that took a minute. Um, but that is everything for this look. Thank you so, so much for joining me. If you have any thoughts, comments, questions, concerns, make sure to leave them in the comments bar down below. I love reading and responding to comments. Um, and that is everything. Today was a little bit more of a low key catch up kind of get ready with me, no purple glitter. Um, but I still had a lot of fun filming it. So I hope you enjoyed this video as well. And I really hope to see you in a future video. Thanks so much, you guys.